Itong problem na sasagutan naman natin ngayon ay uh, katanungan ng ating kawanderham na si Daniel. So, ang problem ay find the equation of the line. A. In slope intercept form, y equals mx plus b. B. In standard form, ax plus by equals c. So, parang yung ano din natin, yung, nakara yung last video natin. Hahanapin natin yung slope intercept form tsaka yung standard form na equation nitong 5 items. So, simulan na natin sa number 1. Uh, the slope is 5 passing through negative uh, 1, 4. So, yung slope daw ay 5. So, M equals 5. M yung slope. Tapos, passing through negative 1, 4. So, ito yung point natin. So, paano natin nahanapin yung equation yan? So, gagamitin natin yung ating formula na y minus y sub 1 equals m times x minus x sub 1. So, itong point natin, itong negative 1, yung x sub 1, yung 4, yung y sub 1. So, isubstitute lang natin dito sa formula. Ito lang dapat natin tatandaan na formula. So, yung y, yung y sa equation, sulat mo lang, minus. Y sub 1 natin ay 4. 4 equals m yung slope 5 times x minus x sub 1 natin ay negative 1 so y minus 4 isulat lang natin equals 5 x minus negative 1 ay plus 1 tapos um, i-simplify lang natin itong 5 i-distribute natin sa x plus 1 so, 5 times x equals 5x. 5 times 1 equals 5. Uh, ititira natin yung y sa kaliwa. So, yung negative 4, itatranspose natin or ililipat natin sa kanan. Pag tinanspose mo yung negative 4, mapapalta ng sign. Magiging positive 4 pag nilipat sa kanan. So, magiging ganito. Y na lang yung natira sa kaliwa. Nawala na yung 4 equals 5x plus 5 naging plus 4 na yung negative 4. So, y equals 5x, 5 plus 4 equals 9. So, ito na yung slope intercept form natin sa so, number 1. Uh, gawin nating standard form naman. So, ba ang slope intercept form ay y equals mx plus b. Ang standard form naman, ax plus by equals c. So, gagawin naman natin siyang ganito. Yung x at y nasa kaliwa ng equal. So, lilipat mo naman yung 5x sa kaliwa. So, 5x, pag nilipat mo sa kaliwa, magiging negative 5x. Sulat mo lang to positive y to kaya plus y equals. So, wala na yung 5x sa kanan, plus 9 na lang yung natira. So, ito yung ating standard form. Negative 5x plus y equals 9. Or kung gusto ng teacher nyo na positive yung x, kita times mo lang yung kaliwa at kanan sa negative 1. So, ang ibig sabihin niyan, pabalik ta rin mo lahat ng mga sign. Yung negative 5x magiging 5x, yung positive y magiging negative y, equals yung positive 9 magiging negative 9. So, pwedeng ganito yung sagot mo. Ito yung standard form. So, slope intercept form, standard form. So, number 2 naman tayo, ang given, the line passes through point 3, negative 4. So, 3, negative 4, sulit natin. And, negative 2, 2. Negative 2, 2. So, kapag ganito naman, dalawang point ang given. Unang point, ito yung pangalawang point. Uh, walang slope, hahanapin muna natin yung slope. So, gagamitin natin yung formula ng slope m yung slope equals y sub 2 minus y sub 1 over x sub 2 minus x sub 1. So, itong unang point, ang x sub 1 ay 3. Ang y sub 1 ay negative 4. Ito naman pangalawang point. So, ang x sub 2 ay negative 2. Ang y sub 2 ay 2. So, isa substitute mo lang dito sa formula natin ng slope. So, y sub 2, 2 minus y sub 1, negative 4. Negative 4. Over, x sub 2, negative 2, minus x sub 1, 3. So, isolve natin. 2 minus negative 4, magiging 2 plus 4. 
So, magiging 6. Negative 2 minus 3 is equal to negative 5. So, ito yung M natin. Ito yung slope natin. Kapag may slope na tayo, gagamitin na natin uli yung formula sa paghanap ng equation. Yung y minus y sub 1 equals m times x minus x sub 1. So, i-substitute lang natin uli yung mga value. So, y, ito yung sa equation, minus y sub 1 natin ay negative 4. Negative 4 equals, ang m natin na nasolve natin, 6 over negative 5. 6 over negative 5 times x minus x sub 1 natin ay 3. So, simplify lang natin y. Minus negative 4 magiging plus 4. Equals. So, uh, yung 6 over negative 5, i-distribute natin sa x tsaka sa negative 3. So, 6 over negative 5 times x, magiging negative 6 over 5x. Uh, 6 over negative 5 times negative 3, magiging positive uh, times natin yung numerator. 6 times 3 equals 18 over 5. Kasi negative to times negative naging positive. Uh, tapos, yung constant naman dito sa kaliwa, lilipat natin sa kanan para matira yung y. So, yung plus 4, pag nilipat mo sa kanan, magiging minus 4 na. Magiging ganito na. Y na lang yung natira. Wala na yung 4 dito. Equals negative 6 over 5x plus 18 over 5 minus 4 na so ito naman dalawa na constant ipagma minus natin so paano yan 18 over 5 minus 4 uh, kukuha ni natin ang least common denominator so 18 over 5 minus 20 20 over 5 kasi 20 divided by 5 is equal to 4 o, diba? 4 so 18 over 5 minus 20 over 5 is equal to negative 2 over 5 so ito yung pinag minus natin so sulat natin ulit y equals negative 6 over 5x tapos ito negative 2 fifth na. Minus 2 fifth. So, ito na yung slope intercept form natin kasi naiwan na natin yung y sa kaliwa. Gawin naman nating standard form. So, yung x at y nasa kaliwa. So, lipat lang natin to negative 6 over 5x sa kaliwa. Negative 6 over 5x, pag nilipat, magiging positive na. 6 over 5x, yung y positive. So, plus y equals so, natira na lang sa kanan ay negative 2 over 5. So, ito naman ang ating standard form. So, ito yung sagot na natin sa number 2. Slope intercept form, ito yung standard form. Okay, number 3. Uh, the slope is 3 fourth. So, ang slope tayo 3 fourth. Yung slope ay m equals 3 fourth. And the y-intercept is 0 4. Ang y-intercept ay 0, 4. Ang y-intercept ay b. Uh, 0, 4. Ibig sabihin, ang y-intercept mo ay 4. Ang coordinate ng y-intercept ay 0, 4. 0 ang x, 4 ang y. So, b equals 4. Uh, so, ang slope-intercept form natin, y equals mx plus b. So, madali lang. Substitute lang natin yung m dito, yung b dito. So, y equals m palitan mo ng 3 fourth. Kopyahin mo yung x plus yung b, palitan mo ng 4. Yun yung slope. Or yun yung y-intercept pala. So, ito na agad yung ating slope-intercept form. Standard form. Lipat lang natin tong x, 3 fourth x. Sa kaliwa, magiging negative 3 fourth x. Yung y ay positive. So, plus y equals. So, wala na to sa kanan ng equals. Nilipat na natin. Plus 4 na lang yung natira. Positive 4. So, ito na yung standard form natin. Negative 3 fourth x plus y equals 4. Uh, kung gusto mo naman na positive yung x, i-times mo lang sa negative 1 yung kaliwa at kanan. Paltan mo lang yung sign ng lahat ng term. Yung negative 3 fourth magiging positive 3 fourth x. Yung positive y magiging minus y. Yung 4 magiging negative 4.
So, pwedeng ito yung standard form mo. Pwede rin naman to, pero depende kung ano yung gusto ng teacher nyo. So, yun yung number 3 natin. Okay, number 4 naman. The x-intercept is negative 3. Uh, x-intercept negative 3, ibig sabihin, negative 3 yung x, 0 yung y. Kasi, x-intercept, 0 dapat yung y. Tapos, y-intercept is 6. So, ang y-intercept naman, dapat 0 yung x, tapos 6 yung y. So, ito yung x-intercept, negative 3, 0 yung y. y-intercept, 6 yung y, 0 yung x. So, dalawang point lang din yan. Una natin gagawin, hahanapin natin yung slope. So, ito uli yung formula natin ng slope. M equals y sub 2 minus y sub 1 over x sub 2 minus x sub 1. Uh, itong unang point natin uli, lagyan natin ng label. Yung negative 3 yung x sub 1, 0 yung y sub 1. Ito naman, 0 yung x sub 2, 6 yung y sub 2. So, substitute natin. y sub 2, 6 minus y sub 1, 0 over x sub 2, 0 minus x sub 1, negative 3 so 6 minus 0, 6 0 minus negative 3 ay positive 3 so positive 3 so, 6 divided by 3 is equal to 2 so 2 ang slope natin or yung m natin so may m na tayo uh, pwede na nating may? Uh, maybe na rin pala tayo so pwede na nating idiretso to sa slope intercept form kasi itong y intercept na 0, 6 so yung b natin yun yung y intercept diba 6 0, 6 yung coordinate yung y intercept ay 6 so palit na natin yung m na 2 tsaka yung b na 6 dito y equals m 2x plus yung b 6 so ito na agad yung sagot natin sa slope intercept form so gagawin natin siyang standard form lipat lang natin yung 2x sa kaliwa magiging negative 2x positive y to magiging plus y equals wala na yung 2x sa kanan plus 6 na lang yung natira positive 6 so, ito yung ating standard form. O kaya, pwede ring balik ta rin yung mga sign. Yung negative 2, gawin mong positive 2x. Yung positive y, gawin mong minus y. Equals yung 6, gawin mong negative 6. Kung gusto lang ng teacher na yung x ang positive. Pero, sa palagay ko, pwede naman din to. So, so ito na yung ating last na item. Passing through the points negative 1, negative 2, and 5, 3. So, ganun din. May dalawa tayong point. Una natin gagawin ay hanapin yung slope. Slope equals y sub 2 minus y sub 1 over x sub 2 minus x sub 1. So, i-label natin lagi para hindi tayo malito. Negative 1 yung x sub 1. Dapat may label. Pag wala kasing label... Ano, hindi mo alam kung ano kayo. <laughs> X sub 2 yung 5, 3 yung Y sub 2. So, yan, may label na. Pwede na natin i-substitute. Y sub 2 ay 3. Minus Y sub 1, negative 2. Uh, X sub 2 natin ay 5. Minus X sub 1 natin ay negative 1. So, solve natin. 3 minus negative 2. Magiging 3 plus 2. So, 5. 5 minus negative 1 magiging 5 plus 1. So, 6. So, ang M natin ay 5 over 6. So, pwede na nating isolve yung equation. Itong formula ang gagawin natin. Kabisaduhin nyo yan. Kabisaduhin nyo rin to. Y minus Y sub 1 equals M times X minus X sub 1. Substitute ulit. Y, yung nasa equation, minus. Ano yung y sub 1? Negative 2. Negative 2. Equals, ano yung m? Yun sinolve natin. 5 over 6. Times x minus x sub 1. Negative 1. Negative 1. So, y minus negative 2 magiging y plus 2. Equals 5 over 6. x minus negative 1 magiging x plus 1. Uh, 
sige po, sulat natin uli so distribute natin yung 5 over 6 5 over 6 times x 5 over 6 x 5 over 6 times 1 5 over 6 tapos iwan natin yung y sa kaliwa lipat natin tong positive 2 sa kanan magiging negative 2 so y na lang natira sa kaliwa equals 5 over 6 x plus 5 over 6 minus 2 so solve muna natin tong constant yung walang kasamang letter so paano to 5 over 6 minus 2 kailangan parehas ang denominator so 12 over 6 kasi 12 divided by 6 ay 2 so pag minusin na natin 5 over 6 minus 12 over 6 is equal to negative 7 over 6 so palit natin dito so ulit muna natin ulit y equals 5 over 6 x uh, negative 7 over 6 minus 7 over 6 so ito na yung ating slope intercept form gawin na natin standard form madali na lang diba lipat lipat lang 5 over 6x lipat mo dito magiging negative 5 over 6x negative 5 over 6x ang y ay positive plus y equals so wala na to dito sa kanan natira na yung negative 7 over 6 so ito ang standard form or pwede rin multiply mo sa negative 1 magiging positive yung 5 over 6x magiging negative yung y yung 7 over 6 negative magiging positive so pwedeng ganito pwedeng ganito yung standard form ito slope intercept form